Alright guys, so we are currently on the, the skyline. Line. This is definitely the best part of staying at either Pop Century or yeah. Arga Animation. I love having the Skyliner because it takes you straight to Epcot or Hollywood Studios and you do not have to wait for the bus. We are super excited to do this food challenge with you guys. We're going to go to every single country that has the snacks in Epcot. We've done this before. We got the idea from Paging Mr. Morrow, so shout out to Paging. You excited? Mm-hmm. Alright, well we can see you guys at Epcot. Alright, so we ate breakfast and it was super good. Yeah, it was um, I don't know the good. name, but we made a reel from it, so go and follow us. But anyway, we're going to start here in France or Paris, I don't know. It's France. France, because our skyline starts here in France. So, anyway, that being said, we're going to start here. We're going to go into the stores and see, like, which store, which store has the candy. That's all they had last time. And yeah. then uh, go but around yeah. the world. I know this is a weird order, but yeah, like we said, the Skyliner is just like in France for us, so yeah. we're taking a really weird route. It's not even like the end. We're like right in the middle of the World Showcase. Literally the middle. <laughs> this is just what we're going to do. So, all right, let's go see what they have. All right, all they had was a nut bar at the cash register, and we did not want that, so. Oh, Bill can't have it anyway. Yeah. They did have like a little tin of caramel, too, but I think last time we were here, they had a lot more, but... We're not just gonna like buy something unless we really want to try it. So. Yeah. So that being said, we're gonna go to the next country, which is Morocco, which I don't think they have anything either. We'll just take a little look. See. Yeah. We'll let you know where we find food next. <laughs> it's a little tough because I'm used to Mexico and I know my way around Mexico, so my yeah. brain is like scattered right now. I can't. It's so hard to like know yeah, the order. Morocco only has one store yeah and it's just a small shop over here i don't think they have food in there i think it's just yeah. and stuff but we'll see we'll see yeah because like i said i'm used to the mexico ending in canada so yeah we'll see how we go how this goes Thank you. it's gonna be fun regardless because you know Whoa. japan and china always has the best snacks but uh yeah all right so like we said nothing in morocco but that we are not too sad about that because we are in japan now and they always <laughs> have they always have the hookup in here so it's just back in this little area. It's honestly really cool in Japan, so. Yeah, they have the most snacks and honestly probably the better snacks. It's I think they have like the hot. coolest like buildings too. Like yeah. it's just so cool back here. But anyway. I also want to let you guys know pro tip. What day, every day it is, one second. It is August 17th and no one is here. Yeah, literally. So you guys want to book your dates now. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like for next year, because I'm telling you dude, walking, there's no one. So, you know, let's go into Japan, see what they got. And in here, they do have these really good drinks that these we like. These things are so good. I don't remember, I think we just like the strawberry. I don't think yeah. we liked any other flavor. Yeah, we got this one. <laughs> and then let's try this. The strawberry milk, all right. Well, if we're, we're, we can't get two strawberries. Yeah, we tried this, this soda last time too and did not like it, so. Let's try this and some tea. Some tea? Yeah, you might as well, you know. It's you just think regular so? green, okay. and it's unsweetened. What's this one? No, that's gonna be gross. Right, we'll just try this. Okay. All right, so so far we just got this. And then they do have a lot of like coffee in here. Yeah, we and oh yeah, they got more Kit Kats. Ton. Milk tea. So they have a bunch of different ones this time. Strawberry. What I do like these Hello Pandas. Yeah, but those are your local store. I know, I'm just saying they're good. Let's what is try this one? Is it just regular? 50th anniversary? Maybe. Oh, what are those? Like little jello? Yeah. yeah, no, no. Gross. Oh, it's a gummy. No, it's not. Oh. It's like a... Sandwich? Yeah. Like a bun. They have tons of different selection for candy, too. I've like seen, bun. like, I know you, I don't know if you've seen these, but no. you guys on the vlog have probably seen them making these candies. I get them on my reels all the time, so. But what we are going to get are these things right here. Yeah, we love these rice cakes. Just uh, peach not oh apple i think we, I think tried we got that apple last time. let's get the pineapple they got a banana yeah let's try the banana oh you don't like i banana. hate banana chocolate they do have a green tea one i think we tried that though we too. tried the matcha yeah let's um, get the pineapple pineapple's right here oh yeah we can pineapple. try pineapple okay we'll get this and this so far okay these are our two things and they have a bunch of different flavors of chips we like to get our chips in china though but yeah, what is that? Uh, crab or squid? Not squid pieces. And then they do have like these full crabs. 
I don't know what that meat is. Why don't we check out? All right, so it's pretty loud out there right now because they're playing the drums, but we got strawberry milk tea like you saw. And we got the pineapple rice cakes. So let's go ahead and uh, crack this baby open and that open. All right, I'm gonna take a sip of this. It tastes like um, strawberry milk. <laughs> Oh, it is. Why was I thinking it was strawberry milk tea? Mm. It's just strawberry milk. Mm -hmm. I was like, though. yeah, I'm like, it just tastes like strawberry milk. I thought you knew that. Because mm -hmm. you're literally like, let's try this strawberry milk. Sorry. Yeah, it tastes it's like really strawberry good. milk. Um, yeah. Alright, here's the pineapple rice cakes. Mm. Those are pretty good. Mm -hmm. I'd get behind these. I'd rate it. I would rate the milk probably like a 8 out of 10. Yeah, I'd give it a 9. The milk? I think it tastes better than like our regular strawberry milk. Yeah. Like, I don't. I think it's just because it's a little bit thinner. Like, at home, like the Prairie Farm strawberry milk and everything is like really thick. Like, yeah. this is a bit like lighter. That's true. And then these, I would give like an 8. It just tastes like a pina colada kind of. I'd give about 7. As you guys saw, there's tons of selections, so you guys gotta try this out yourself with your friends or family, whenever you guys come around. But we're gonna go to the next uh, country. Oh, the drums are done, but we're gonna go ahead and go to the next country and uh, see you guys there. All right, so here we come to Italy. There's two shops here, and we'll see what we can find. All right, so we just walked through the Italy shops and there was like actually no candy in there whatsoever not even like something we just didn't want like they literally had nothing in there so next we're gonna store. yeah next is Germany I believe so let's hope we could find something because otherwise this is gonna be a fail yeah we finally found some candy chocolate candy mm -hmm. alpine milk we tried these last time and they were really good the hard candies yeah let's try these you want to try it we have, that. we have that in uh, America. The only one we don't have is this one, which you cannot have. Yeah, it looks like just the hard candies are chocolate or these biscuits. Mm, we can try the biscuits. But you there's wanna? also another store too, so. All right, we'll go look over there and then we'll if not, back, yeah. we'll get the biscuits. All right, we got end up getting these because the other store was just caramels and we have those in everywhere else in America. Yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and try these trackers. They did have some pretty cool merchandise, stuff like that too. So while you guys look for candy, stuff like that, you guys can also go shopping for merchandise, obviously, but it's like what cool stuff they have. Already melting. Yeah. Ah. The problem is, yeah, it's kind of- Oh, they're oh, all they're like little gold. pieces. Yeah. Oh, you didn't get no quacker. Yeah, yeah. Right. Oh, maybe I didn't. There we go. That's what it kind of looks like. It's good, for sure. Mm -hmm. It's just like milk chocolate a with like a cracker. <laughs> so. A little crunchy sweet kind of action going on type of action going on so if you guys like that i would probably give it like a good i mean probably like a seven yeah i'm not good, much of a chocolate fan not anything crazy i would agree yeah. like a seven china and china has a lot of good options yeah so let's go ahead and go over there we're not going to keep you guys waiting or, any longer it might be norway oh yeah it is norway. I don't know the world uh, showcase that well so, so hard whenever like well it's also hard i think because we're going out of order yeah but all right Let's go to the next door. How about that? <laughs> All right, Krista ended up being right. Yeah, I shouldn't have second guessed myself. I knew what it was. It was China, so let's go ahead and see what they have. Okay, so besides the obvious tea and stuff like that, they have tons of different options. Is this beer? Yeah, they're beer. Beer flavored chips. They look kind of different flavors. Yeah, that's the barbecue. They have all kinds, so we're just gonna try to show you guys and then I'll end up showing you what we get. We get all kinds of different. Or this? That's the grilled squid. Mm. And then, yeah, we tried the crawfish before. It's not this good. is the duck. Oh, that might be good. The duck, yeah. We may end up getting the duck. And then some candies and stuff like that over here, too. Hmm. I think you tried one of these last time yeah, and, and you did not good. like it. No. But those things are good over here. These? Yeah, the individuals. Yeah. I kind of like them. There's all kinds of cool stuff though. Yeah. We're gonna pick something out and then we'll pick up the camera outside. All right, so we're sitting in like, literally just on a step over here, but yeah. it was the only place in the shade. And it's hot, so. We did right. end up getting the duck chips. So. Oh my. 
lot of pop, but you guys smell it? Mm -hmm. You guys smell that? All right, here we go. They smell like um, like just like a Chinese cuisine, to be honest. Oh yeah, they do. Ah, pretty hmm. good. Yeah, I mean, it tastes like um, like some kind of like stir fry, honestly. Mm -hmm. it tastes like stir fry. I'll probably rate it like a good eight, honestly. It's mm -hmm. a stir fry, so duck chips are good. Yeah, I would give them about an eight too. They're pretty good, and I like yeah. the crunch. Like these are like really kind of yeah. Thin. Well, this is a premium bag, you guys. Mm -hmm. I, it was hard to open this thing. The material's there, man. They just do different over here, I guess. Mm -hmm. Well, a little bonus. The Lord provides. I asked for a drink and we got one. Yeah, we just saw one. It's like I a honey tea. Yeah, I think it's a honey green tea. We'll find out. We honestly don't know. And we're still in China, so yeah. it's a little bonus. It's very, like, pure fun. Here, I want some tea. I know, it's just up. <laughs> I was like, it's putting the cap on a little bit. How was that? Good? It's okay. It's just like, it's like, it's just a tea to be honest. Yeah. Probably like a five. Yeah, I think a lot of the teas that they do are like unsweetened, yeah. so. But, five. I mean, it's a drink, so I'm fine with it. Yeah, it'll keep me going. So, all right, now we go to the next one. <laughs> all right, so we're in Norway, and this is what they got going on in here. Yeah. I think these like a little, oh, they're milk chocolate wafers. We tried a drink last time, not that drink, but a drink like it. Yeah, and we tried those um, ginger thins, which were actually really good. They have a lot of just like chocolate. I'm trying to stay away from the chocolate. That's what makes this hard. Yeah, because pretty much every place you go will have chocolate, but we don't want to have chocolate every single time. I wonder what this little thing is. Oh, it looks like caramel. Okay. Like chocolate and caramel? Yeah. yeah. All right, I think we're gonna just pass on this store, guys. No chocolate for us yeah. right now. It's just too hot. But just to show you what they have. Yeah. All right, now we're back in Mexico where we should have been to begin with. Yeah. But we just got here. All right, so we're in Mexico and same kind of thing. It's just yeah. chocolate. But I'm not too worried because Mexico's not the last place we're going. Nope. We're going to Canada and the UK, and they both had good candy last time we were here. Yeah. So, and we'll see. the chocolate that they do have that we like, we've already had before, and the others like these like chocolate covered beans. So, you know, we don't. I don't recall for you. Sorry. Yeah. So, but yeah, it's super nice in here. It's so cool. But and, uh, the only thing I was gonna say is. Since we've done this before, it's yeah. hard to find new things because yeah. a lot of places don't get new snacks. No. So if you want to do it multiple times, I mean, you can. Yeah. But I think the first time we did it, we pretty much got a bunch yeah. of things that we <laughs> wanted to try instead of just one item. Yeah. So that would have done us better if we just got one item the last time and then we could come back and try more. But Yeah, I think the next time we do this, they'll have to be like when my family's here yeah. and get their reaction. So this is probably going to be the last time we do it, just me and Chris. Um, until we have some kids or I go with my family or something like that because yeah. their reaction will be funny. Um, and so also, yeah. with the chocolate too, it's like, obviously different countries have different chocolate, but yeah. they're not that different Overall either. So. So. so yeah, our last spot is gonna be UK. So hopefully they got a little something for us. Last time I think we <laughs> had those um, honeycomb things, oh, which were yeah, good. Yeah. I remember so. those. those were pretty good. We'll see what they get. So here's what it looks like they got in the UK, which I think we're gonna try these fruit gums. Yeah, we're gonna get those. They've got this section over here too, which looks like a lot of chocolate, but they do have more things. And then these are like little raspberry cookies too. All right, so we are ended up getting the fruit gums. Fruit gums. So I'm gonna open them. They are vegan. Also, a little hidden gem, guys, if you guys made this this far throughout, go to the back of UK. There's like so much cool scen scenery and sitting options available pretty much at all times. So, yeah, well, yeah. it's just right by toy sh the toy soldier. Yeah, so yeah, you want to head back there and have a little seating area. And there's quite a bit of shade, too. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and get one. Charles Mike. Oh, <laughs> pretty good. No. Oh, the one I got tastes like tea litter. Mm. The red one? Yeah, it actually tastes like, it, it tastes like the smell of tea. No, no, I got the purple. Mm. It tastes I'm like blackberry. I'm not a fan. Sorry, guys. One out of ten. They're so bad to me. I give them like a six. I don't love them, but they're pretty good. No offense, but I think it's because they're vegan. <laughs> 
All right, yeah, like I said, I wasn't too big of a fan of that at all, but you know, you gotta at least try it. You gotta be willing to try it. But yeah, this is a super fun challenge with your friends and family that anyone can do. Um, I am so glad that we were able to come and do it. We literally picked out outfits just for this, so. Yeah. It's pretty funny, um, cause we gotta come back tonight. You guys will be watching this way later, but for the food and wine and all that, so. Anyway, I just wanted to, uh, encourage you guys to go ahead and do this. Really, if you just come with like a hundred bucks, you can get a lot of stuff, because the huh. last time we came, we actually got something from every booth, mm -hmm. or every, um, country, and we got under a hundred bucks, oh, so. so. You can definitely do it. But I think that's just going to be a wrap on the vlog, guys. Alright, well, thank you guys so much for watching, and we will see you next time.